Real women murders, not fiction. Love women, don't kill them. Giving real women, unknown women, recognition to the world. Please support our channel and please, please subscribe. breaking news. While you were sleeping, the Clayton County Sheriff's Office sent out an alert about a kidnapping and death investigation near a high school. Within the last hour, we got a significant update on the case. 11 Live's Ariana Moniz is live at Lovejoy High School. You've been following this throughout the morning. Ariana, break down what happened with this victim and what we know about the suspect. Well, Sheriff Police tell us a 19 year old woman was shot and killed by her 20 year old boyfriend and the road behind me that runs alongside Lovejoy High School is where police say the situation ended. Now the initial call came in around 11 p.m. last night. Police they got several calls about the 19 year old being kidnapped from her job by the boyfriend at gunpoint in Fayette County. Police they chased the suspect's vehicles here into Clayton County and where it all ended here at Lovejoy High School. Police say the suspect fired several shots inside the car, also firing shots at police multiple times. Police, they were able to get the suspect out of the car using a tear gas. That's when police say they, they found the 19 year old inside the vehicle with several gunshot wounds. The 20 year old is now in custody, charged with kidnapping and aggravated assault. Now this investigation, although police cleared the scene, they're still investigating this situation. Police tell us Clayton County Police they will handle the homicide investigation. As we continue to get more information from police will be sure to bring that to you live on air as well as online. Back to you. Ended in a hail of bullets outside Lovejoy High School this morning. Good days. Caitlin Pratt is live at the scene where we just got new information from police. Caitlin, good morning. A very disturbing, a, a toxic love relationship uh, turning deadly. So let's get to the video of where this situation ended early this morning. It all began, though, in Fayetteville, according to police. Uh, a 20 year old uh, being identified as Cameron Hopkins uh, went inside a restaurant uh, armed with a gun, uh, took his ex girlfriend, uh, age 19. She's not being identified just yet. Uh, it, dragged her into his vehicle, a red vehicle. Uh, people at the restaurant called 911, so police were able to get a description of uh, that car. They gave pursuit, and that uh, chase went from Fayetteville here into Clayton County and ended at Lovejoy High School, where police apparently deployed uh, what they call a pit maneuver to disable that vehicle. Well, that didn't end uh, the ordeal. From there, according to investigators, uh, that 20-year-old uh, opened fire fire on police, then turned the gun on his ex-girlfriend, uh, ending, ending up shooting and killing her. Now, he was eventually taken into custody. Apparently, uh, deputies deployed some sort of uh, gas, some irritant uh, to distract him. And uh, he's now facing several charges, both in uh, Fayetteville and in Hampton. Uh, again, the suspect uh, named as Cameron Hopkins, age 20, that 19-year-old victim not being identified just yet. We're going to stay on top of this situation for you, bring you the latest here on Good Day Atlanta. For now, we're live in Clayton County. I'm Kate. Thanks for watching. 
we appreciate you. Please, please subscribe.